Happy New Year. How we doing? How does, how does how we doing? We're doing we're doing it's the new year? The third? I'm home. I was uh in Mexico for about a week. It's always fun. Love being in Mexico. Um be, oh, why do I have this? Right. So, I need to lower this music. <laughs> Hello, it's gonna be a chill day, night. Probably a chill night, short stream. Uh, are literally just gonna be strip mining. It won't be too bad though, because I'm strip mining in 1.16 chunks, meaning we're not gonna be in deep slate. 
We're gonna be in uh, the old diamond layer level area, which is gonna make life a little bit easier for us. Um, so, hold on, let me see, where, where am I? Okay, this, no, this way. I'll take you to the, I'll take you guys to the hub. My hub. Um, yeah. Oh, wait, I forgot to do this. Okay, so. We're in my original uh, strip mining area, which if, uh, if you haven't, if you weren't here when I started this world, you've never seen this place before. This place is literally, it's, it's just, up there is home. Up there's home. And down here is hell. <laughs> no, but, um, so I wasn't gonna mine on stream. I wanted to stream because if I don't, if I didn't stream today, I wasn't gonna, I wasn't gonna be able to stream until, sorry, this music is too loud. I can't hear myself think. I was gonna, hi. Um, but zombies keep spawning here. I started, I started working in this area on my own. And then zombie, there's like a horde of zombies right in here. And I killed them all. I went exploring. I found some weird stuff. Look, I'll show you whatever. You can hear the zombies because they're here. I don't know where they are right now, but they keep appearing. I think it's because there's that mechanic where they call on each other. There's also a weird guy over here. Hold on. I found him. Where's the weird guy? Still here? I think this guy put himself in jail. He's, he's I think he's stuck in there. But we're going to be strip mining. I don't want to be stuck up here. I've already done some mining up here. The thing is, there's just so many zombies and they keep keep appearing I don't like do you hear that they're like they're like over here they're like a where are they there I don't know where they are I just hear them in like this area there's one of there's like two of them. lots of zombies I'm finding I don't want to come exp whoa I'm in full netherite armor that wasn't <laughs> that wouldn't have hurt me even if it did blow, oh, it's getting out, oh, it's getting out, it's getting let loose. Too high up. Oh, hello. I'm so sorry that bat had ears. It startled me. Ugh. I don't even know how I hit that guy. Oh, absolutely not. See, they just keep coming. They just keep coming. I don't know where they're coming from. Oh, I'm so bad. I'm such a bad shot. I'm trying to light everything up over here. Make my life a little bit easier. I can light most everything up here. Oh, that bat scared me again. And I 
can go back to strip mining because I got stuff to chat about. I'm talking about my trip and and what my plans are for the new year. Lots of monsters up here. Glad I'm clearing this area out. Oh, there's a guy over there that. Thank you, business. Is there lava down there? <laughs> oh, the music scared me. Okay. See that creeper? I've been up here a bit. I'm getting a good amount of XP too, so I can make a new bow. Soonish. Okay. That was a bit ridiculous. <laughs> oh. A lot of stuff here that I don't need. That. That. Keep the bones. That, 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 that. Okay. Ooh. Or. Keep getting more or. I don't feel comfortable just chatting aimlessly until I'm in my strip mines. I might need to start a new one because of absolute maze of. Put mines I have going for me downstairs already. Should take some of this. I actually I don't need any of this iron. I have an iron farm. <laughs> okay, so I need to be careful because there is some creeper. Despawned. Totally could have despawned. Don't remember going this way, to be honest. So I'm just not gonna go that way. I'm gonna go this way. To be a good place to start mining. So I have. Oh, that's what. Oh. Problem with trying to strip mine, but not wanting to let go of your. <laughs> Torches, or you not let go of your totem. It's that you gotta swap for the torch. I'm going to be ignoring iron. I'm forcing myself to ignore the iron, considering I have, literally, I have an iron farm. I don't need that iron. But like the bird brain in me, the little goblin brain that I have, it's so like ah, oh, more shiny things to collect, more little things. Um, so yeah. Oh, actually, I am gonna be taking the redstone though, because I don't have a lot of redstone. And I've been surprisingly using redstone. Anyway, so I went to Mexico past week for New Year's. I spent some time down, uh, down with my family and celebrated there. It was a great trip, you know, after. So here's what happened. I went down to Mexico and I was, I was getting ready. I was packing night before, doing some fun stuff, getting stuff done. Uh, and I was all packed and my last thing was like, okay, I just need to grab my passport. Go to grab my passport and it's not where it's supposed to be. And then I stayed up until about 
four in the morning looking for it. Never found my passport, so gotta find that. Uh, still looking for it at the moment. Luckily, with Mexico, it's... I don't want to say luckily, but I just, I have my birth certificate and my ID, so I was able to not worry too much about it. Anyway, so that was the bi first big conundrum that was going down to Mexico. Just couldn't find my gosh darn passport. Then, after that... Yeah. It's so weird digging at 11 now. These chunks should all still be old chunks. So if I don't find diamonds, I'm really, I am looking for diamonds here because I don't have a good way to find. Actually, I might. I need to do some experimenting. Anyway. So. Get out of Mexico. It's only about a four hour drive. Um, once, once we're down there, it's like, okay, we're good. And then wake up the next morning and my face has broken out in like weirdest breakout I've ever had. I, my my face doesn't break out in like acne. I get pimples. I get pimples occasionally, right? Everyone gets pimples. But I don't have... Oh, there we are. I don't have full-blown breakouts. That's, that's never something I've, I've had. Um, but I, I woke up and like I, I had seen my face getting red the, on the drive down because where I was sat, I was able to see myself in the rear view mirror and I kept looking at myself and my neck and my cheek and I'm like, oh, getting red. And it was so weird. I'm like, why, why am I getting red? I didn't say anything and then I woke up and my mom's all like, what is on your face? Total breakout, really weird. Never happened to me. My grandma, she's like, okay, here's what you gotta do. And she gave me Neosporin. She's like, just rub that all over your face. I'm like, okay. She's like, multiple times a day, put that on your face. Okay, that's weird, but okay. And I did that. I would put it on two to three times a day and break up cleared like perfectly fine. And my mom was like, no, it's a rash. It's a, it's a, it's a, it's a allergic reaction to something. But I hadn't taken anything. Like there's nothing my skin should be reacting to. No, it was, it was like no reason for that. The only thing I can think of is I had I was trying out a new like exfoliator from Lush and I'm like that's probably what did me in. My mom thought I was having like a full on allergic reaction to like something I ate or something. Uh, so that was like first day. I'm like oh, okay, well shucks. Also first day woke up and I'm like oh, I had like my allergies were kicking my my butt. I don't need that. But there was gold in here, wasn't there? Did I see gold? Oh, I, I to put it Yeah. So, I also spent a good portion of my New Year's like with horrible allergies, like my my. My sinuses were acting up on me. They were like, they were making me like, and no one had Mucinex. I was like, okay, I'll be fine if I just get my hands on some Mucinex and no one had Mucinex. But I did learn because of, I should, you know, I should be learning from my mistakes. I did learn that Vix has this little thingy, a uh, little stick, like, you know, Vix Vapor Rub. We all love it. We all swear by it. But they, they also have this little stick. And it's like, you're supposed to inhale it. It's like putting Vicks right into your nose. And gosh darn if it's not strong. And gosh darn if it didn't help. It was great. Um, yeah, and then... Other than that, everything was fun. I got to go check out like some of my favorite spots. I got to chill and be on the beach for a while. I caught, I collected some really good, really good rocks that my grandparents are gonna bring back with them because I forgot to pack them. And then my grandpa was like, "You want your rocks?" And I said, "Spider somewhere." I said, "Can you bring them back for me?" Because I was already in the car. Ooh. Hello. Oh, and 
and it's a... Uh... Okay. I'm taking the gold because I don't have a reliable source of gold yet. I haven't made a gold farm. Uh, gold farms scare me. I'm actually surprised I haven't found more diamonds. Because these are all pre-generated chunks before one point. Whenever the, uh, the, the terrain update was. Also, uh, I'm going to that. I got the recap up today. Let me check on that. Pausing it. Yep, recap's up and it's fully processed. So I can go drop that on the Discord. I can go bother my poor Discord people. Bothered my poor, bothered my poor Discord people. So recaps up, and um, speaking of YouTube, I have some plans for YouTube. I already have two more videos in the works, kind of. I guess you could say two more videos. I have one completely recorded. I have to edit it together, which is going to take a bit, especially because I have two like full days of work tomorrow and the day after, which I'll be up late working on that, and I have to figure out a thumbnail. Which is fine, I can do thumbnails, I can do all this. All good in the hood. I just, I have two videos planning and one is the start of a series. So videos for 2024 uh, already gonna be fantabulous. Thing is, I'm making a second channel. I guess technically a third channel. My second channel is my VOD channel. I'm making another channel. And this channel is gonna have, um, first thing I'm gonna do is gonna move some of my videos I have from my current channel over there. And then I'm gonna start working on a new one. So I technically have several new videos in the works. Um, there's just gonna be a while till we start seeing any. I, it took me a bit to even get the recap ready. Well, actually no, the recap was pretty easy. I got all of the videos, the clips together yesterday. I was up to like, almost three in the morning doing that and then I edited it to all together today and because I didn't make any new custom art for the thumbnail uh, I didn't have to spend an additional hour or two on that so it's all good it's all been it's all been great I'm actually really happy with the recap video I'm really happy with how it came out I think it was it's really funny um really it's really good it's really good <laughs> there's a horse in the uh thumbnail so it's even better. But yeah, I've already had the channel set up and if you go to my channel and you go down to the other other channel section, next to my VOD channel, you'll see the new one. It's Cryptid Bobs. So we have Bobs VODs. Then there's Bobs the Cryptid, which is my main gaming and PowerPoint channel. And then there's um, Cryptid Bobs which is gonna be kind of like my video essays channel. Uh, essentially, anything that's not a PowerPoint, but it's still me talking about stuff I like, it's, it's going there. Uh, I already have some, so like the How to Train Your Dragon video is getting moved over there. The uh, Cryptid Corner videos are getting moved over there. The, I think that's the only two I think the, the 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 Minecraft theory videos are staying because they have to do with my like video games and stuff. Because my main channel. Oh, hello. Hello. How about you? Six feet. Oh, I hate this. It's dark. Ooh, almost right into the lava. I don't like the darkness. 
Anyway, so the uh, How to Do Dragon and the Cryptid Corner videos are going over there, and any other kind of essay videos I do are going over there. I'll keep my Minecraft theory videos over here because they kind of are kind of. Uh, <coughs> I feel like they're still chill. They're short. Okay, well. Shut up. Well. Should be fine. Cover it up. Perfect. Okay. Um. I think I also have a, a video I took me a long time to work on and then I just never edited it because I got really busy and unmotivated but I still have everything I want to edit together stuff that's staying on my main videos or any kind of uh, gaming videos like the Roblox or the, the um, lethal company videos any kind of big videos I put together from streams and any of my Minecraft series like uh, Crimson SMP or Shattered Empires SMP or future project I'm working on that I'm actually really happy for excited to work on and all my PowerPoints all those PowerPoint videos because I do have more plans for those PowerPoint videos silly videos like that that aren't really me this they're not really me talking about things I like me doing things I don't know hard to explain but things like that are uh, what I'm going to be keeping on the main channel I've not found any I'm in the desert. I should be finding diamonds. I'm gonna try something. Let's head this way. Back towards home. -ish. Making a maze for myself down here is totally the smart thing to do. I'm, I'm gonna see how it goes. Because, like, I feel... Like, my main channel is definitely more focused on video games and gaming. And that'll be my main focus on stuff. Because that's what I do on stream. That's what I like to do. I like making videos like that. Funny moment compilations and all that. It's fun to me. But there, I also love talking about things I like. Just going on rambling and writing essentially essays. And then just reading off the essays. It's, that's what I'm doing. That's Cryptid Corner. That is other videos I have planned. So I'm moving Cryptid Corner over there. All the videos are going to stay on my channel. I'm just reposting them on the new channel starting this year. I don't know exactly when I'm going to start that, but like soonish. Hopefully my Suchinoko video gets better. Uh, does gets better views because my Suchinoko video did not do good. I went back and rewatched it. I'm like, what did I do wrong in this video? What's going on? Yippee. Chloe! Yippee. Yippee. Hi, dude. Isn't it like... Well, I guess it's not that late for you. Um, hi, dude. Thank you for subbing. How have you been? I'm rambling to myself over here talking about my plans. But yeah, so second channel where I'm going to be posting more of my essay videos where I just kind of ramble um about things i like main channel staying everything that's on the main channel right now is staying there like i said it's all just gonna get reposted and uh, but yeah i was was like my Tsuchinoko video i'm like okay let's see compared to my comparing to my frogman video it's significantly better i want to see what i did wrong with this one nothing is I, I thought it was a good video still i thought it was a good video i might get a, 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 a I don't know, so maybe it's just like a bad time to post. It just didn't get the traction it should have. Or, mm. I've been good. Last semester of high school starting tomorrow. Dude! Have a good semester then. That's sick. Ah. Water. Any diamonds? It's gonna be fun. The school's five months of how left? Dude, it'll be over before you know it. 
and then you can find new hells to enjoy. I just oh, come up here if I need air. I don't. Okay. I'm excited for you, dude. I'm excited. You're gonna kick its ass. Whatever semester, your last semester, you're gonna kick its ass. What else? I had other things to talk about, and I can't remember what I was gonna talk about now. I think I talked about the main things of my trip to Mexico, and then I talked about my plans for the new channel. I was talking about the recap video that's up right now, live, got dropped now. Um, I'm doing really bad on diamonds, which really is upsetting because I'm 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 in I'm in pre 1.18 or 1.19 chunks, so I shouldn't be doing bad on diamonds. I should be should be finding diamonds galore. Oh. Time to turn around. Out of I'm out of supplies. I'm out of room. I wanted to mine. <laughs> Maybe I, I really didn't want to go deep sleep mining. That's my thing. Maybe I'll go back to the pit and keep going down. The pit's a good place to dig. I can go over there and dig. Find diamonds, I'm sure. The whole chunk where I've just deleted it. Hell, who knows? Maybe I'll find a, 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 a fossil. I haven't gotten to levels negative whatever it is yet. I'll get down. I'll go down to negative 53. I think that's the level. And we'll start strip mining over there. But I think I'm still far away away from negative 63 or 53. Lock me up. You'll be wearing my crown. But yeah, I wanted, I, I, I late stream today, but I wanted to stream today because I'm not going to be able to stream until Sunday and it was either now or not be able to stream at all until Sunday. And I did not like that. I like streaming. I like streaming. Kind of stream more. And then I was like, what do I want to do? I want to do hardcore Minecraft. Because I always want to do hardcore Minecraft. I always want to play Minecraft. The thing is, I don't want to work on my build right now. A lot of plans for it. I just don't want to work on it. Zombies see you from so far away. I don't need you to do that, zombie. I have priority. Those priorities are going home and going memes. Oh, I was like, that door is taking a really long time to close. There's a pressure plate. There's a pressure plate. <laughs> I got so much coal. I'm actually really excited about all the coal I got. I love coal so much. It's such a weird thing to like. I just like it. Oh. But I only got four diamonds, which is what I've been mining for. I mined for about half an hour, which is uh, really a horrible mining trip. Well, seven diamonds total, which is not what I need. I need a lot of diamonds. But I can use this moment to do a little bit of a test because I thought I saw something. I'm not wearing my elytra. <laughs> I was like trying to fly there. Not wearing an elytra. Hey. Hey. Where's your, where's the boy? Where's the child? There's a child somewhere. That did not help. 
child somewhere. Look at my fish. You guys mimicking zombie noises? Was that my birds mimicking zombie noises? Yeah, I think that was my birds mimicking zombie noises. Um. I'm gonna check something. I remember seeing something, but I don't remember if it was true or not. And if it's not true, I'm gonna look a little bit of a little bit a little bit silly, like a little bit of a silly goo. I got more. I got I'm so happy. Oh, you guys don't care. What the heck? I got more of floating sacks. That's actually what I needed a lot of. I was running low on those. Oh. I have a lot of uh, a lot of stuff I could break down. Actually, let's put all this stone away. I'll break all this down eventually. I don't need it yet. Also, work the. Pretty close to food. I, I, so what I also did over, um, vacation is I planned out, I planned out a, uh, oh wait, oh wait, that hurt a lot. Planned out the layout for the upper level of, uh, the City of Tears. Use a diamond tool. I need an armor smith. Or let me see. I'm gonna I'll buy the diamond tools and then or do I have diamond things I can let's try smelting some I know this is gonna sound silly, but I swear I heard that you can now you can now smelt diamond tools and get a singular diamond back. Just one diamond. Just one. And if that's true, I'm gonna need to bring uh, more of these more guys up here to get more stuff. I don't know if it's tools though. That's the thing. I don't know if it's tools or only armor. If I'm wrong here, I'm gonna look so silly. I see right there. How are you? What? The? Hold on. No. Why is there a frog out? I don't have a safe place for them yet. So that's why I have them in containment. Frogger! Come on. Come on, dude. Is this a new frog or is... Oh yeah, I have a new frog here. I guess one of the tadpoles I didn't pick up when I was making the farm. Interesting. Or I lose another work box. As going this way. Okay. I'm gonna try this. And if my if my thing gets plugged up, oh well. It, it'll be an easy fix. I should disenchant them first. Get myself some XP. Free XP while I'm at it. Oh, that doesn't work. It doesn't work. Ah! Oh. Doesn't work. It doesn't work. Okay, that's fine. I just have I, I didn't waste any of my own diamonds testing that. Now I want to test if it's armor. I have a lot of diamond. I have a lot of diamond armor. Do a quick test. 
I, I just, I'll just use one of these. I swear, it might have been like a, a, a gotcha moment. Yeah, okay, it's fine. It was a gotcha moment. I fell for a prank on the internet. Someone went on the internet and lied. And I feel so embarrassed. I'm humiliated. I'm supposed to know things about Minecraft. Oh. How dare. How dare. You have to, uh... You have to prepare this pick, though, so... Do some trades. Glad I don't need to get any armor smiths or anything like that. But I'm red, I'm mostly dead. I'll have to clear that up soon. That iron farm is too good. I might actually have to come up here and get more coolsmith. Because he's too good. He's too good. It's, it's a too good. I was almost tempted to make a double iron farm because I'm like, oh, I need, I need more iron it's not where it's working now it's working now and i don't need another iron farm i have so much iron i wish i start buying quartz from these guys just slowly over time i'm gonna be needing quartz for the upper level at least maybe even not even up till i'm gonna need quartz for the kingdom for the the city the fact that I'm just kind of wasting my quartz over here. Is it getting late? I should really have a clock. I should really have a clock in here. So much stuff. So much stuff and none of space. I need more toolsmith and more cartographers. Probably. Um, what can I sell to you guys? I know some of these guys take books. Yeah, maybe I have some books to, to sell. Maybe while I'm here, I can check the time. Wow. I don't have a clock in here. Um, him for books. Books, books, books. Oh, I have plenty. Plenty. Might need more soon, but I have plenty. I don't know why I'm building up in this shape. Sixty-four is not divisible by three. Don't know I dig it. Well, it's 60. Technically, it's 63. Do I have axe? That is silk touch, but luckily I brought this guy up. Fortune. Sorry. By the time I'm done with this, it'll be nighttime and I'll get to go to Mimi's and I will do all that stuff. Maybe I'll go looking for a stronghold over by my ancient city area. That'll be funny. If I found a stronghold over there. Make getting home a lot faster. What does that give me? Ooh. Yeah, that's good. Good amount. Go bother fast villagers. Um, you like this? Like this stuff? <coughs> um, I want to sell them yet? You like melons? I have those. That's a that's that's. A <laughs> 
certainly a thing to say. I've only been streaming for 46 minutes? What? That feels wrong. Like, incorrect. Definitely look into another either Woodland Mansion, which disgusting. I don't like going there. Or probably a stronghold. I get get good stuff at strongholds. Strongholds I think is where I got most of my books. I don't I'm not good at Woodland Mansions. I don't think I've ever the, the vexes always kick my absolute butt. I keep I'm never good at Woodland Mansions. I'm more scared of Woodland Mansions than I am of the ancient cities. Like, I, I, I did really good in the ancient cities. I do really bad in Woodland Mansions. I know I got other stuff. Just down here. Cool. That means I can do some sales you used to give me better deals. You used to give me better deals than that. How dare you? Do I need more melons? I need to check how my melon farm is doing. I haven't AFK'd up there in a while, which means it might not be producing the melons I want it to be producing. Last though, to make that. I'll do the round. I'll do the round. Uh, hello. You like books? You, you like my melons? That's weird to say. Iron, Put more iron. You, I don't have stone for you, but you can quartz. Melons. I'm doing amazing. You, nothing for you, nothing for you. Huh. 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 I think I've, I've, I've outstayed my welcome here. Um, <laughs> I have so much stuff. I have so much stuff. I can even just leave extra materials in here. Oh, I should probably be taking the spare quartz. I'm going to need a lot of quartz. Like, I, I won't be able to get it from here unless I get a lot more stonemasons. Sunbasins are not worth it. I'd, I'd rather just go mining for the quartz in the nether than stone mason it. Though, I have the villagers. I could just get some more stone masons. Nothing wrong with that. Let me see how much quartz I have, actually. I feel like I'm going to need a lot of quartz. I'm going to need a ton of quartz. I hope that's not just it. I hope that's not my quartz supply. Oh, please do not be my quartz supply. Oh no, I might be absolutely out of luck with sports. Wait, no, I'm, I lied. Gosh darn, not that by that much though. Oh boy. That's not a lot. We're gonna need quartz. I'm not gonna start collecting quartz yet, because that's the. I don't need it yet. Um. What do I need to do, though? Now. 
Oh, I was gonna check my melon farm. A melon farm that's probably really not well. No, doing great. It's doing great. Don't want to know. Don't want to know where that guy went. My business. None of my business. I said we're probably gonna go to the uh. uh we're gonna go to the pit. The pit's a good place to go for potential diamonds. Probably keep a, a water bucket on me. That's probably smart. Despite the fact that it takes up a whole inventory slot. This is literally just a mining stream. I don't want to do anything actually productive. I don't feel like building right now. Um, Even though, like, I've made a lot of good progress and I have plans. I have, like, plans for this area. Like, you see, actually, I might change that, but I have down here for theaters and place stuff, and then right next door is going to be, like, the movie theater for, like, uh, movies, and then right here, I think it's Information Hub. That's essentially a library, but, like, I can't call it a library. A uh, small cafe right next to the school and the library and this little shop here, which is a little supply shop. I don't know if I'm going to do an interior for that. I might do an interior for this have for like the theaters the stuff over here might have interiors um motel or something probably won't have much of an interior swimming lessons office so i put this here because right through here right through here is this little area which is maybe i'll i'll work on some terraforming there today i get bored of digging but yeah so we have the swimming swimming lessons office because there's the, essentially the little swimming area back there um I don't have a plan for this little hole yet. It's like right next to maybe like another lawyer or something. So oh yeah, so this is cemetery and then up there is gonna be a place of worship. So I finally figured out what I want in this area. Uh religion. But weird religion. And then we have catacombs and crypts. So not like fantasy I don't know exactly what it's gonna be, but it's it's gonna be religion. I have like a whole little section area. So I have plans for that area. I have a lot of plans. I just don't want to work on it right now. If any, I want to do something kind of like mindless. He dodged. Thank you. I've been needing slime balls. Thank you guys. I appreciate your sacrifice. Um. Take these right here. I'll use them. I'm gonna use them to build up this little wall here. I have this little wall being built up so none of the, the little monster guys that would be here normally can get in my my pit. Despite the fact that this is very much still able for them to get in here. This is supposed to be a pit of safety. Doesn't feel very safe. Now I feel like it's getting nighttime. And I made my pit bigger. Made it difficult. How low am I? I need to get down to negative 53. I'm at negative 14. Um, maybe I'll relocate the beacon. I made it down there, but I I need I need some kind of precious. just well, I could make it have what I need to furnace. For iron. Some more here. Just so I remember I have that. Okay, 
it, so we're gonna... Boop. I don't even have to make these out of emeralds anymore. I could... I have so much iron that I could totally make several be I have more beacon pyramid materials than I have beacons. I could totally beacon up my area. I would just have to spend a lot of time getting the withers for it, which is kind of not something I want to... I don't want to... I don't feel like grinding withers at the moment, despite the fact that I could. I have my little wither cheat area. Um, technically, I could try to do it in the end. I could try to do the wither boss fight in the end. Uh, probably wouldn't be a great idea because the last time I tried to cheese it, I failed. So my way of cheesing it works best for me. Which is I just go down into deep slate area, uh, dig a little hole, let it do its thing, and then I fight it. I mess it up. Absolutely destroy that thing because it can't fly. If it's underground, it cannot fly. So I can just chug a strength pot and absolutely demolish it. Okay, I cannot tell if this is just regular rain or thunder rain. We're going to find out. I missed the last thunderstorm on this world because I was in an ancient city. And there's a clip of that because the thunder scared me. What I hate about thunder is that you can hear it no matter where you are in the overworld. <laughs> you are, you could be literally at the bottom of the world and you will hear, you will hear it. That's just, that's just, that seems unfair. Seems like, ah, uh, illegal. I should have two stacks and 36. If I don't have two stacks and 36, that means I lost some somewhere. I do not. Oh. Right here. I see them down there. Really feels more like a thunderstorm. Oh, I found where all of them went. Left all my torches at home. I've lost a singular. Well, I didn't leave all of them. A singular. Really, a singular. Singular. Solo uno. I don't know why I said that. That was that was Spanish. I said it like I was speaking Italian. Oh, there it is. I knew I'd find you. I'm gonna try to sleep. It feels too dark down there. No, it's just no. It's a normal, normal area. out not for bring that bed down here Fortunately, I don't like how dark it gets in this singular corner I don't like how dark it gets up down here at all I don't know why I have just water here I feel like I did this wrong it's been a while since I built a week
Should do a beacon hunting. See how many beacons I can get in like two hours. I'd just be, maybe not two hours. Maybe it'd be like I have two hours to get as many uh, bowls as I can, and then I have another two hours to just see how many withers I can absolutely demolish. Go up and get the iron. Oh, villagers, fast about this then. They don't need to, they need to mind their business. Hey. Haste two. Doesn't do much for deep slate, but it's, it's enough. So I'm gonna I'm gonna see what why I, I think I put this water down. I did this. Like I don't remember why I did this. <laughs> Oh, I didn't. Okay. Oh, forgot about that. Oh, hello, little guy. I'll let you, I'll let you, I'll let you vibe. You don't hurt me. So there's no reason I should hurt you. You know what? That's a little better. That's honestly not bad. Not bad. Not a bad. Not a bad guy. I love slimes. They're so little and cute. Even the big ones are kind of cute. They're just, they're, they're large and they just want to hug. And they're just so, so big that they kind of squish you a bit. That's not their fault. They're trying their best. They're just big, they're just big guys that want to hug. Might need to make torches. I love big digging. This is like one of my favorite things to do in Minecraft is just dig big hole. Dig big hole and then dig a bunch of small holes. I just, strip mining is one of my favorite to do. I don't know why. Just, I guess the repetitive task, just go straight and then you get rewarded by treasure. Dig, dig hole, get rewarded by treasure. It's, it's that one, that one, uh, <laughs> That one uh, meme of the dude digging and then giving up right before diamonds. That's me, but like unironically, I'm just like, I keep, I keep going. Only time I ever turn around is if I can, I hit too much lava, hit too much water, or I um, run out of materials to keep going forward. Like I'm out of torches or I'm out of uh, space to carry more things. Then I, I'm like forcibly, forcibly turned around by my circumstances. Are you stuck down here, buddy? Let's get you out. Let's just get you out from up there. I need more torches. Oh. Yeah. Digging hole, unironically, just really fun task. For me in Minecraft. 
Oh, another thing that's happened to me recently is I found my Switch. I, I didn't have my Switch for a really long time. It fell under my bed and I didn't realize it fell under my bed. So like I had no Switch. I thought I had torch. Oh, I do have torch. I'll just break it down there. Oh, I need wood. Oh, you are not a cute little guy. Can I sleep? I can sleep with you there. But you're just chilling. You, I kind of have to break up. I kind of have to split you up into a few pieces, guys. I, I, I'm really sorry about this. But you have to understand. Oh, I and I cannot. I cannot. One guy is fine. That many is not. I'm gonna go cut down some trees. Those guys still there. Boo. Boo, I say. Acacia wood. Got trapdoors, I think. No. What do I like acacia wood? I don't know. Oh yeah, I like the gray bark of it. I was like, I know I like acacia wood for some reason. I just can't remember. I like the color of the bark. The good color. I use it for a build, I think. I can't remember what build, but I used it for a build. Probably those that time I was doing really colorful houses. I'm so happy I made those houses on my testing world before I built them in the game. Now I have those houses forever. <laughs> and I, I love those beach houses. I love those little beach houses, man. They're so good. Dude, first I'm gonna make a boat so I can collect my little guy. And then I'm gonna make this. Then I'm gonna have to do this. I wish there's a way to do this faster. I had dump, jump boost. If I had jump boost, I'd be able to do it faster. Mark hole. Weird things I love unironically. Digging, mining in Minecraft. I hate caves. I like chip mining or digging big hole. And coal. Coal is like my favorite my favorite like mining resource i like i like using coal as fuel i like using like i like i like using coal it's, it's a good it's a good good it's it's reliable it's all reliable Did i lose my little guy because i flew up I, lose, I lost my little guy because i flew up oh my god i'm so dumb i'll put i'll put the boat like In memory of my little guy. In memory of my little guy, the boat goes there. Now we just keep digging. Onwards and upwards, or I guess side to side. I got some good music playing. I got my pickaxe doing its thing. We're good. We're doing good. I think I might do a stream where it's only about withers. I'll give myself a two hour timer to get as many wither skulls as possible. And I won't start the timer until I hit a good uh, fortress, a fortress where it's like in the soul sand valley. And then I can just kind of run around doing the thing, doing the thing, doing the business. Oh, I need agua. I run around doing the thing. Two hours running around, killing, getting as many wither skulls as possible. And then I'll give myself, and then I'll go try to get, maybe not. I don't want to limit myself. I'll give myself a goal to read. Like then if I, it's, uh, I'm thinking. Might have to do a vote for that. Like, 
what should I do? Like, should I give myself a time limit? See how many wither skulls I can collect within that time limit? Or should I give myself a goal on how many wither skulls I need to collect? Because there's like, there's a difference. If I give myself a time limit, it's always possible that my luck it will just be awful. And I won't have a drop. If I give myself a goal, same thing could happen. I don't have a single drop. Or I'm not, I don't get a good rate. And then I just have to, oh. We reacted to the video. Oh, toast. Like I give myself, I give myself a goal on a certain amount I need, and then I'm just like, oh, rate's bad, and I, I have, I have to go. I'll be there for like five hours trying to get wither schools, like twenty wither schools, and like five hours later. Of course, I could always make like a wither skull farm, but like I don't want to. I don't need beacons that much. I don't need. I it would literally just be for the flex, getting beacons. Literally just for the flex of being like, look at my cool hardcore base and all of my beacons. I don't need it. It would be smart to have the beacons around like the city. Like if I, I, I read probably what I'll probably do is get need beacons for the city. Um, and then each tower I'll get four beacons. Each tower I'll have a beacon at the at a certain point, maybe five beacons. So like one in each tower and then one in the castle. And then I just have like regen on everything. I'd, I'd have to see, but then I, I wouldn't, they wouldn't be full beacons, not because I don't not because I can't make full beacons. I just don't know if they'll fit. If a full beacon like this nine by nine will fit in the tower. It... I hear a skelly. I don't like hearing skellies in the mines. This is my mine. These are my, these are my areas. Oh, wait, yeah. But. I think I do want to put beacons in the city area. I might have to put some beacons around the base too. Regen beacons would be nice. Regen beacons, I feel like, really nice to have around the base. Especially if I want to actually start going out at night. I really want to get my base fixed up. My my spawn chunk looking nice because I mean it doesn't look bad. It just around the house looks all right, but the cats are a mess. <laughs> the cats are a mess, so I want to move the cats to like the perimeter of it to keep like spread them out more to keep creepers at bay like outside of my spawn chunk. And then I want to get a nice area for my frogs and axolotls. And then I want to get a nice area for Ramthony because right now Ramthony is just, he's just chilling. I'm going to put a bunch of these in. A lot of stuff. I have way too much stuff and not enough stuff. Space back sword. I might need to make another shulker. I have so many shulkers though, I don't need another shulker. I'm like a Roomba. I'm like a Roomba. Except if a Roomba was like had eyes and could see where the particle dirty things were, they could choose to go towards them. Might also need to make another trip to the end. Get more, um, Oh, 
getting dark. Absolutely getting dark. I need to have a watch on or like a clock on me. I don't like being vulnerable at night. Despite the fact that that is not how I've died technically in my hardcore worlds ever. How have I died? What are the ways I've died in hardcore? There's the iconic first one. Okay, after I had a, I had a hardcore world month. I had a hardcore world for two months. My first hardcore world ever. I'd never done hardcore before. And I blew myself up with a bed nether mining. Bed netherite mining in the nether. Beds. I uh, blew myself up. You know, as one does. Oopsie doopsie, whoopsie poopsie. Second world, I died off stream because I um, was not taking it seriously at all. Died off stream trying to fight an Enderman that I failed to fight. I uh, was really bad at fighting an Enderman. I died. I wasn't streaming because I'm stupid and I tried to fight something while I wasn't streaming. Um, then my next hardcore world, I did a bit better on than my second. Third hardcore world, I did semi decent. On. It wasn't two months though. It was not longer than my first one. First one, at the time, was still my best, my best hardcore world best run third one i also died in the nether again because i didn't realize piglins could open wooden doors and i decided to pick a fight with the piglin because i'm like okay this guy's in my house i'll just fight him the other guys won't realize that i'm fighting one of their dudes and then they they realized i was fighting one of their dudes and they opened the door and been like well hello there and he he rocked my world in the worst way absolutely knocked my world in and i lost that hardcore world hardcore world number four i started immediately after i died in hardcore world number three and i lasted 10 minutes because i thought i was safe and a creeper snuck up behind me and blew up literally no one's done it worse than that no one's done it worse than that and so i have this world now this is Hardcore World number five. In May, it'll be three years old. Uh, how many days am I at? I'm at 2,000, over 2,000 days. I'm doing decent. I shouldn't jinx myself, but doing decent. I have how many hours though? Uh, this is six. Uh, it's time played time played i'm at 20 days of gameplay on this server on this world i'm trying to think 20 days how many hours is 20 days that's 24 hours so 24 hours get to 100 hours that's about 100 hours is about five days or just just under five days just over four days i should say is 100 hours so if, if about four and a half days is 100 hours i've played on this world for about 500 hours i want to say what's 24 times 20 and <laughs> that'll tell me how many hours I could just I have a calculator. Oh, I got I got a text. Sorry, I had a I got distracted by a text. Uh, so 20 times 24, right? 480 hours, but it's also not only, but it's not just 20. It's like 20 point something. Time play, 20.48 days. That's 
what's 20 48 times 24 that's almost 500 hours i've been on this world i played almost 500 hours on this world that's insane that is insanity what the hell 2000 days 500 hours almost <laughs> that's so wild that is so wild to me 500 days five 500 hours almost 500 hours that's that's insane to me what the hell and i feel like i haven't done a lot like i feel like i could be i should have done more so i don't like saying oh i've had this world for three years because technically i have and i've played on it semi-regularly but it's like i feel like it's just, i haven't done a lot and then i look i have a whole mini city build it's fine it's fine one of i that's why i really want to get done with the first layer because i feel like it's taking so long and i have plans i have plans so there might be a break between building the first finishing the lower the lower level of the uh city and then i might have to actually go build a farm I, I might have to build a farm that might take me a while and uh it's gonna be my guardian farm because i need prismarine things i can't keep going for um can't keep looking for new new water temples i need to make the one that's like literally in my backyard practically into a farm and i'm not gonna drain it i'm gonna make one of the ones that you don't have to drain i saw one like that I, i'm not draining an ocean monument i cannot i don't think i can do that <coughs> i do not think i could drain an ocean monument not only would i be too scared to take off all my armor and invisibility i i i I would I don't think I could do it I don't think I'd, I think I'd be too much of a chicken I'm gonna look I'm also the build I want to work around with the not drained city I want to make a pretty cool build on top of it um that I don't think would work as well if I tried to what's it called drain the city Putting all the ores I don't need up here. I'll probably come back for this gold. Actually, I might just keep the gold on me. I don't need the iron. I need the redstone. I don't need the iron. The iron can stay here for the beacon. The gold, I actually don't have a solid source for. So I might hang on to that. all of this and once i have that choker filled i'll go take it to the um i'll take it over to my area my city oh i'm probably gonna have to be trip over there now I'm doing this for diamonds what i also want to do is go tear down a um a bastion preferably the one that i found the other day because I didn't explore it that much. I need the blackstone. So so it's like kind of like so I can get the blackstone and I can um get the blackstone and I oh I'm taking this over. So I get the blackstone and I get to potentially see what's in look at that. I love how that looks. So yeah, I have a plan for the top part. I have a layout what it's gonna look like I just hope I have enough room well I might actually have enough room <laughs> it looks small but at the same time big so it's gonna be like a water area on the out outside most and like some waterfalls and then there's gonna be a like a layer of trees after that and then there's gonna be the buildings I don't know if I'll have enough room for all that though I don't know. I honestly don't know if I have enough room, and that makes me a little bit worried. Plate, plate over here. 
Boom. Oh, this is gonna be great. I'm like, two birds with one stone here. I'm looking for diamonds, making the pit deeper, but also I'm getting all of the deep slate I need. Cause last time I went mining down here, I, um, I, I, I dug up a lot of the deep slate. <laughs> I up a lot of the deep slate with my my silk touch pickaxe, which was a bit of a dumb move for me, because can't make all the different things out of silk touch. I have to use I, I can't out of the the regular deep slate. I have to use cobbled deep slate. It's just so ridiculous, so 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 dumb. I did that, and I have so much smooth regular deep slate that I don't want it I have nothing to do with so it's hmm, maybe I'll use it for the upstairs area oh I also have to fix my enderman farm it broke again and it's my fault I don't have a solid system for it so I need to go up there and make a solid system for it uh, I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to fix that. I don't think I'm gonna fix that today, cause I, I really don't want to deal with endermites and all that. But it'll be fine. It'll be fine. I also have to figure out how to. Um, I need to make a little system for the ender pearls that I just put the ender pearls in. I don't know if I want to make it manual or not. I, I need to figure out how to do it. There's a way to do it where it just you can activate pull like pull a piston and it'll start just spitting out. I'm not redstone savvy, but I want to look try to figure out on my own before I um before I uh, look up someone else's tutorial. That's what I did with my Enderman farm. I didn't look up a, someone else's tutorial, which makes me really proud. The Enderman farm. I mean, it's not that hard. I just had to look up like, oh, how? I can't remember what I did. I don't think I followed someone's farm. I think it was just like, oh, I just had to look up what to do. Like, how high do you need to make? I looked up how high you need to make it to make it sure an Enderman's at one hit. And then I'm like, oh, okay, I got it. That's what I got to do and how far I looked up. Okay. I had to look up how high I had to make it and how far away from the end island I had to make it. I think. Unless I looked at it all. Unless I completely made it. I don't know, man. I don't know. But yeah. I, th I want to say I made... The, and the Enderman farm is like mine. Like I didn't look up a, I looked up some like information, but I didn't look up a step-by-step -step tutorial. That makes me proud. That that's the only one I did for that. I, I'm not good at making farms. I'm good at exploring and dig hole. I explore, I dig hole, and I build things. I wouldn't even call the things good, but like I build them. I do that. Actually, what I want to say is that I think I've gotten really good at like a lot better at building I think I've gotten a lot better at building um because I what I was doing I wouldn't today most or I guess technically yesterday yesterday and today I was going through a lot of my videos from this year a lot of my videos from this year and I mean I don't have that many that's why my recap is like 35 minutes long and not a whole hour or something because I have just I didn't I didn't wasn't able to make as many videos as I wanted to this year but it's a call but um especially when I was going through the crimson SMP videos there's like seven or eight of them right went through those and I see my first build which is the ranch area and I was so proud of that that I was really proud of how it came out even though I fixed it a little tweaked with it a little bit because I had a, a diagonal build, I had detail, it was it was cute, I was really proud of that. And then like I just kept building things. And then the bank came along and I was also I didn't love how I made the bank. I would if I went back and did it again, I'd probably try to redo do the bank a different way. Redesign the bank. And I did not like how I made that bank. And then 
I built the sheriff's building. Um, sheriff's building, I think, was the first build that I looked at. Actually, no. It was the, um, the diagonal building I liked. But, like, the sheriff's building was the first build I looked at. I'm like, I like how this looks. I, I'm proud of how I made that look. I, I'm happy with how that looked. I think that's... It was, like, first... It was, it was really good. I really liked the sheriff's building. And then I made the museum. The museum is probably one of my favorite... One of my favorite builds from this year that I've done. The museum is was like such a good such a good build, I thought. It was like I and I wish I had gotten more time on that server because there's other stuff I wanted to add in it. Like I wanted to add in a bunch of wanted to have every disc in the game in there. I wanted that's what I wanted that in the museum. Um I think I wanted some other stuff, but I just I didn't have the time. Also never got the egg. A little salty about that, but what you can't what can you do? What can you do? Fair play. I wasn't lucky. But um built a museum and I'm just like wow. I'm really happy with that. The amount of detail I did on that, the like the just, it's just a really the color palette. The color palette I did on that was like I don't even know how I did that. I don't remember. I remember kind of designing it, but I don't remember how I came up with the, the block palette I was going to use. Just like, what in the world? It's It was so pretty. And then I built the chapel. I still like the museum better, but like, I feel like if you look at, it was because of the vibe, it was a very similar, like, small type of build to like the ranch or the sheriff's building. Whereas like, I was at the centerpiece of the town. Oh, hey, Oreo. How are you doing? But, um, built the chapel and I loved how I did the chapel. Like with the roof, the unique roof. I had the little bell tower. And just like seeing how my build, I'm doing good. I'm, I'm doing good. Enjoying the new year. Got my, getting my first stream in of the year. Um, it's been, it's been, I've just been mining this whole stream. I'm just digging rock. Diggy, diggy rock. But, um, what was I saying? But, like, just like comparing the first build I did on that server to the last build I did, last two big builds I did, it's just like, what in the world? I've, I've gone really good at building. Or at least I've gotten a lot better at building, I should say. I've gotten a lot better at building. Uh, saying I've gotten really good at building, I think, is a little bit overboard, but I've gotten better. I think a lot of that, I think, when I want to say a lot of that is because playing with snow and seeing how snow builds and how snow textures, it's just like I'm, I have a little notebook out and I'm like writing and taking notes. Also, I watch a lot of Minecraft YouTubers that also helps with like building techniques and all that fun stuff. So it's, 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 it's interesting to see how my building has come along, like how my skills in Minecraft have come along and, um, I'm just, I'm happy with it. I mean, I guess you could even compare on this world, like how my build used to be versus how they are now. Um, but even then, I'm kind of really proud of how my builds on this. Even my older ones from like over a year ago are pretty good. But compared, there's a lot less detail in them compared to like what I'm working on now in the city. It's, 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 it's peculiar, I think. It's, it's strange to me. Like, I'm, it's, I, I love how my, the builds I have in my spawn area look. It's just, it's not quite the same. It's hard for me to, hard for me to like explain. <laughs> like my spawn builds are pretty. I love my house. I love my village area. I love my wizard tower area. They're all good. But like the level of detail that I'm working, like I have a lot of more details in my city compared to my spawn chunk. And I think that's obvious. Like I think it's very clear that there's, 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 there's been some growth there. I'm not saying I change anything. 
Actually, I probably would change the tower a bit if I ever got impatient. I'd just turn off the spawner and redo the body of the tower. <laughs> because I didn't have a good concept of texturing. Still don't. I'm not great at texturing, but like I had... I have a, a bit of a better concept at it than I did when I built the tower. So it doesn't look super great. But it's still, I think it's still, it's still a cool build. I think the house, my haunted house is like my first try at gradients. And it, um, I don't think it looks the way I was thinking it would, but it's still, I still like it. I still like it. And I think my favorite build in my spawn area is definitely the, the villager temple villager temple just looks good i think also like my trees i like how my trees came out i'm not good at building custom trees but like i like how they came out i still i don't understand how to build them and yeah i'm still happy with how i built them <laughs> so i have a i'm working on a series right now it's, it's a single player minecraft series that i'm really just going to be focusing on building so it is survival, so I have I have to do have plans for it, but it's it's uh so much here. I was at negative fourteen when I started digging. I'm at negative eighteen. I've dug four layers in like half an hour. Oh my god been about half an hour and I've only dug four layers deep slate also I'm digging out this huge area it's insane but like I want to I think I wish I could do this when I had just a video in the background at the same time I like talking <laughs> I do I like talking it's fun I'll take one more layer and then I'll probably do another delivery and then go back to the Base. I might actually want to look at some stuff at the spawn chunk to see. Do you think? What's also interesting about the house is that over time, every time I start not liking something, I just change it because it's and also it's not. It's supposed to look kind of like worn down and rugged, which I think it does. I think it does look like a house that's been kind of that's kind of old. What I love about the house, though, is that it's shaped pretty good. Like, it's not... I don't feel like there's any side that's super flat. The only side that would be, like, considered flat is, like, the back area where I have my, um, super smelter. The super smelter area definitely is a bit flat, but it's so low to the ground in the back with, like, the, the, the dirt has come up to it. It doesn't feel flat because it's a lower the the walls are on the outside are only two blocks high and the dirt is like right next to it and then i have a big tree back there so it's like you're not really not really flat back there it just kind of feels like it gets getting like reclaimed by the earth which is that's kind of what i'm going for kind of what i'm going for with the whole with, there's literally trees Literally trees and foliage and moss coming out of the, the house. Wow. Oh. <sighs> literally, literally trees and stuff coming out of the house. I have two crackers left. Oh my God. I have two Ritz crackers left. Mission sequence. I'm mouth. talking about 
Oh my god. Wait, hold on. No, it should be fine. My what on my last stream. I know, I was like a week and a half ago. Last stream, it, part of it got muted because of the song Dance Till You're Dead. The remix I have on I had on my playlist, I took it off. It got muted. Not because the dude the, the, the song I used was the was same. Somebody's remix of the song I used was same. And I could have said this song is not in my playlist. This is not this is not the song you're hearing. Because I've done that before where I had like a Legend of Zelda song play and there's an artist who sampled the the uh specific Legend of Zelda song in his song and he was like oh claimed and i'm pretty sure like i have no idea but that felt illegal that felt illegal so i just i said this song isn't in my isn't in my stream and they're like okay but for dance till you're dead it was like almost the exact same song it was just slightly differently remixed i'm like i'm not gonna have this fight every time this is I'll I'll let I'll let this guy have this song. Dance of Your Dead's a good meme song, but like I'm not not about to fight somebody over it. I'll let other people do that. Like you can't you cannot if you if you sample a song from like a video game, you cannot claim copyright claim that song on Twitch because everyone's gonna like it's a video game song. Everyone who's playing like Legend of Zelda on Twitch is gonna have that song now and you're gonna be like, oop, my money. And then they can just be like, no, you're incorrect. You get nothing. It's so stupid. Sorry, I'm just mad. I like Dance Till You're Dead. It's a, it's a fun song. A really fun song, funny song. So I get a little bit upsetty spaghetti when I think about that. I'm gonna go do a delivery and then do a thing in my bobber. See that? It's rainy outside. I definitely need to figure out what's gonna happen here. I think the, what I decided to do is that this side is going to have the like little gondola trolley up to the second level and that side is going to have one and then yeah so and then actually hold on how far apart is it? 1, 2, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 hmm <clears throat> That is like perfectly nine across. So maybe from here, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine here. Is this nine across perfectly? Um, hold on. Oh, I might just, I might have just gotten distracted. I have, so I need four. I think I have, I have, I have enough. I absolutely have enough iron. Um, kidding me? I'm like, Crapping iron out. I'm gonna need to stop digging for deep slate for a bit. I am full of deep slate. We need to. We're gonna go the fast way. I hope this is faster. I never actually timed how fast it is. But also, so it's going to be like gondola ride down and then it's probably going to be like there. And then right here, there's going to be a big old statue. That's the plans I have. And then over there too. <coughs> I 
Um, collect some iron. I'm gonna do some testing. I need four beacons. Four beacons worth. So one. Two. I'm trying to do this in a way that with one so it's like nine much but my, my throat just got really dry for absolutely no reason whatsoever totally not the uh crackers i like absolutely demolished right now okay. and then if i put the beacons in here first i can or the the pyramids in here first i can figure out how to build the base like the tower around it be good oh it's gonna be good full beacon so i have like regen 2 in here at all times city is gonna be absolutely gorgeous oh my god that's perfect i didn't even plan this out when i was building these towers that's insane they, they still, they still, they fit. They fit. Oh my goodness. And then I have some plans. I, I'm thinking about things right now. So it's like, I got plans in motion. I got plans in motion. So let's just take a nice leisurely stroll to the other one. <laughs> Good fly to it. But why fly when you have leisurely strolling? Half of this upper city is going to ha not have rain, which I think is very funny. What they deserve. Ooh, I thought I wasn't gonna make that. Hey. So now I think we might actually have a goal. Four beacons. That is, I'm gonna need 12 Wither Skulls. So next stream might be a Wither Skull stream. I don't know. Or I might play Seven Days to Die because I was watching some of my clips from that because of the, you know, the whole recap video. And I kind of miss playing that, but I, I think I need to play that on like a Saturday night or something or Friday night, Saturday night, a, a night where it's like there's low chances of people having to be up early the next day because I feel like seven days to die is that game specifically because I play with the Twitch plugins. It's a lot more fun when I have the actual interactions and like can get those funny moments in like when you guys spawn the bears on me endlessly. Uh, <laughs> so it's like, yeah, so I need, I can start planning out what I'm going to play again. I also want to get back to Skyrim 
I haven't I still haven't beaten Skyrim although I don't think I ever planned to beat Skyrim I think I was ever always just gonna be like I'm gonna do all these little side quests and whatever happens along the way happens I should sleep but like I'd rather keep doing this because I'm ooh, so much more successful when I was walking across The fact that this perfectly fits a beacon is kind of insane. I wasn't planning on having a beacon in here. Like, that was never the plan. The plan was always... I don't. I knew I was going to have, like, some kind of build at the top, but not a beacon. And I'm kind of just in shock and awe that this... So, next hardcore stream might be a... I don't know if I'll do the withers right away. Because what if I kind of want to, like... Might want to do something else. Different game. Or keep building down there. Because I have a lot of plans and I've made a lot of progress. I might want to just keep building. I didn't want to I knew today was gonna probably be a shorter stream and just chatting and not really want to do things but I didn't want to do the buildy bits today ah fudge I'm gonna mess it up okay I'd like to be over here away from where I can get ambushed from either side. I think swift sneak is faster than walking. I don't know yet. Hold on. So walk. Swift sneak. Okay. No, it's a, I think it's like slightly slower. It just fills really fast Ugh. no 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 uh. absolutely we don't kill us oh my goodness There was gonna be one under there. Whoa, ow. This is gonna be something. I'm gonna need to hunt down 12. Well, actually, no, I'm gonna need. Because I said I was gonna do a fit. So I'll probably. Let's four times five. 20? No. I'd need 16. Yeah, 20. Need 20 weather school. Twenty wither skulls, and then I need to fight five withers, which I've already think I've already technically fought five withers. <clears throat> this is very fun. This is very cool. I'm actually really happy with this. 
not. Just because that area is not lit up does not give you the right to. Oh, two more over there. Can I shoot them all the way over here? One. I can definitely shoot two. Get out of here. Spiders. Spiders. Hit him. Oh, so close. Yeah. Yeah. Demolish them. I actually just go back to home base. Oh, cause I need to do some. I need to do some, um, healing up of that. That's actually, I'm actually really surprised. That's perfect fit almost. Absolutely insane. Asleep. Are we? Oof, lots of baddies over there. This is why I say I need to fix up my area because it's just like, so many things can spawn. I want to kind of spawn for a bit. I want to look at my base a bit. Honestly, yeah, I'm still happy with how this looks. Because it looks like a rundown house losing its paint. It looks like it used to have paint and nice walls and like it's slowly like the wood is rotting away. Paint's rotting away. There's mold and moss growing everywhere. Spider webs. I think I also did a decent job of Kind of make it look boarded up on some side so it looks like i think it looks good i think i'm happy with how this looks this could be better it could be better it really could be better like the bottom's good up here is where it kind of slacks off this is like my favorite build of my spawn area not super detailed but like the color palette i'm actually really happy with the 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 texturing the uh the every i'm actually really happy with how this came out the the villager temple is definitely one of my favorite things i've built in spawn chunk let's do some trading i definitely had more cows here i definitely had more cows there that's concerning. I don't know where those cows went. I mean, I don't need them necessarily, but I like having them. Books and the iron. Uh, you, not yet, you. Alone. You iron. You port. You. Ah. Way too much stuff on me right now. Shove that in there. Shove that in there. I re I'll regret. I'll regret that later. Um. Iron. Fast. This is my this is my XP farm for now. While I don't have, while I don't have my Enderman farm working. I gotta get my XP this way. Definitely gonna need more stone masons up here, I think.
Melons! 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 Oh, you take melons up here? I've been neglecting this guy. He also buys melons. I'm really more concerned with selling iron. Or these guys might be... No, I can't come on. Okay. My last book? That was my last book. Melons? Nope. Definitely gonna need more stone mason. Ding. That's that's all I can do. Oh, that's all I can do. I'm almost at 50. You. You will buy. You will. I have no books. I have no books. Ooh, you are new cat. That's a new cat right there. This box alone, I have enough to make. Almost three beacons. That's, oh wait, hold on. Almost three begins. That's insane. Positively insane. That's absolutely ridiculously bonkers. Okay, let's go. Store our quartz and our iron, I think, or our lapis. I think that goes downstairs, actually. Lapis goes down, downstairs in the enchanting area. Boop, boop, boop. Little, little, little. Okay, and with that, I am gonna end it. I'm gonna end it here. I think, I think we did, we had a good time. We had a good time. We did good. Uh, where's my ending screen? Uh, there we go. Okay. Hmm. Let me just close this out so i'm gonna check something real quick yeah, okay so thank you guys so much for watching um i that was good good first stream of the new year something simple something easy we just mined for a bit we just chatted and it was it was good it was good next stream i want to say it'll be sunday uh hopefully if things don't get in the way i want to say i'll be able to stream sunday um keep an eye out for another new video because i already have i have the footage i gotta edit it together um so yeah keep an eye out for a new video and i will hope to get that out to you sometime next week and yeah i think that's it okay have a good night happy new year and i'll see you guys in a see ya bye